Hey guys, it's Louise here and welcome back to my channel. So today we have episode 8 of Andor. I always need to check what episode number we're on because we've had so much stuff releasing recently that I'm so like lost with everything. Um, episode 8 of Andor. I am excited to see where this episode goes. Um, all the episodes have been wonderful so far um, and none of them have disappointed. So yeah, I'm always excited for more. Uh, we're, I feel like we're slowly getting closer to Callus. You know, one day. Um, look, I can dream, okay? Let me, let me dream. Um, but yes, thank you guys. God, I have done too many videos today. I am suffering from my flu injection and my second COVID booster. I'm sick. I'm stressed. It, look, we're not going to talk about it, okay? Let's just fucking get into the episode. <laughs> Hi, so I am here to interrupt this current video because I have something to show you guys and I'm really excited. So, I got sent a very, very awesome gift um, from Movie Palette and I am so freaking excited for this. So, you're probably wondering, what is this? Let me just take it out of the plastic real quick. Okay, so this is a canvas. And as you can see, there's a lot of colors on it. And down here you can see it says, well, you can't really see that, but it says Star Wars Episode 3, Revenge of the Sith. So this canvas is uh, colors that are picked from every scene of the movie. Let me, let me just do a full screen for you right now. How cool is that? This is such like a different design than I've ever seen before. And I absolutely love this. So thank you so much to Movie Palette for sending me this because this is absolutely beautiful and I cannot wait to have that on display behind me because it's really, really cool. It was really quick delivery as well. I was really impressed by that. Um, but you can have, if you check out their website, you can basically, you can choose your own custom movie, but there is a big range of movies already listed on there. Um, and there's like episodes from TV shows like Stranger Things, for example. You can have Star Wars. You can have Lord of the Rings. You can have even animated Disney movies. Uh, it's There's so many options to choose from, and I am absolutely obsessed. This looks so freaking cool. So if you guys want to get yourself one of these, and you would like a 15% discount, then use code LOUISE15, numbers 15, um, for a cheeky little discount. I highly recommend it. And this is also great for a Christmas present. You know what's coming up. It's very soon. It's it's catching up quicker than we expected. Um, so if you're looking for a really good uh, Christmas present for a nerd or a artwork enthusiast, any of the sort, this is perfect. And I'm so glad I got Revenge of the Sith. Revenge of the Sith is my favorite Star Wars movie. And what better way to celebrate a Star Wars video by showing a Star Wars uh, canvas. So yeah, it's really, really awesome. So thank you, Movie Palette, for sending me this. This is absolutely awesome. Um, I am very honored, and I will probably most likely be buying some in the future. <laughs> so thank you so much, and I hope you guys uh, enjoy it. I hope you guys go get yourself one, because they're definitely worth it. It's really good quality as well, I must say. Um, it is, It is beautiful. So yeah. Oh yeah, he was in jail the last time that we saw him. I wonder how he's gonna get out. I'm still feeling like he's gonna find a droid. Manage to reprogram a droid somehow. And that's gonna be K2SO. I hope. That'd be cool. I mean, it might not happen because I don't know how you do that from inside a jail cell, but we'll see. These intros get me every time. They're so fucking good. I love it. They're being transported to jails. You're not a tourist anymore. You are officially a prisoner. Ugh. Why do they have to go bare feet? That's gross. He's such a mood. Oh. I'm Lieutenant Edra Mira. I'm the ISB supervisor for the Morlana sector. Ferex. Oh. Oh, okay. I'm here for this duo. I'm calling you in to fill some gaps in the report. You know, I would hate to be in that interrogation room. It's so white and bright. 
my sensory issue said no. Holy fuck. That was one hell of a secure prison in the middle of fucking nowhere. Good luck swimming. You are not Arwen. You cannot- Oh my god, the fucking sinkholes in the water as well? Fuck. They really got this place unlocked on. It's a large investment. It's a fraction of the price of lost technology. I love how bold she said. is. Find this piece. Identify Axis. They escaped together. It's the first best lead we've had. Ah, so it's Axis is Luthen. Has convinced me. Drill down, find Andor, and get a hunt started. I hate that I'm rooting for her. I want her to go through with this. <laughs> Cause she's so good at what she does. Feet down. Well, you're not gonna be lifting them up. Oh my god. What the fuck? Thanks to its oh, the floors. That's why they can't have shoes. Keep to your lane and this needn't be more than a memory. Oh, that was horrible to look at. Fuck. I get their shoes now, why their shoes are so thick. It makes sense. I will inform the Bureau of Standards that you were of service to the Empire today. I feel like they're both very similar with their loyalty. Never be too aggressive in pursuit. Forget this happened. Why doesn't she just let him work with her though? Like he's determined to find him. You need you need to find him, so like why not? I don't get what the issue is. I said step off now. Move. I hate that he's being so hesitant. It's making me anxious. Like just do what they this. say. Is unit 52D. Level 5, room 2. No. Is, for is that 7 levels of factory, 7 rooms per level. Is that Andy's 7 tables per room. My name is Kino Loy. I'm a 52D unit manager. Andy Circus. Nine men in this room answer to me. Name. Holy shit. Keith. Keith Gerber. You're mine now. Oh, I'm so happy. A program. Back to work. Don't ever slow up my life. Oh, I love him. <laughs> Table five. Oh, I hope he's like a regular now. Like, at least throughout the prison scenes. He deserved more after, Table you know, five. Snoke. You know, been waiting. So what do we call you? Let's go, let's go. I'm just as lost as Cassian is. No idea what the fuck's going on. No, I'll have hers. Oh, that's gross. Of course he likes extra mind. worms. Well, good luck feeding the galaxy. I'm off to feed myself. Charity begins at home. Yep, goodbye. Leave. Be gone. Signals coming. Oh. It down. God, Cassian is so good with his facial expressions, like his emotions. Secret code, what are you telling them? Oh, that is a lot of prisoners. That is terrifying. Palpatine's frustrating. Yes, we agree. Yes, Palpatine is frustrating. Overreacting. Water, nightlight, toilet flips down, got a plate, spoon, and shaver. I mean, it's convenient. The two. Get into your booth, Cassian. Don't be a dimwit. Cassian. Cassian. Why are you- God, she's always serving every fucking outfit she wears. She is just- It's just- Look at her. She's a goddess. God really has favorites. No, Mon became a senator at 16. So this is where you met? No, we'd already been married a year. You're romantic. At 15? Very traditional. The old ways of Chandrilla. Why does it feel like it was forced? Greek people are jade. So nice to meet you. I'm going to spend more time at his window. I promise you. I mean, honestly, I'd be spending my entire days at that fucking window. This is how they wash. 
This is fucking brutal. I mean, I know it's prison, but like, my god. I'm intrigued as exactly what they're building. It's like parts of the Death Star or something. <laughs> I'm throwing a party. I love that they're looking after her. Where did you go? <gasps> they're back together! Yes! Why did they reunite? After what we've been through. You think the Empire stops to catch its breath? This is a fight to the death. I mean, I'll be honest, Cassian's not coming back anytime soon. Not you to hear. Just let them be happy and in love. Don't split them off. What are you doing? Are you sleepwalking or are you doing this on purpose? I wonder, I can't tell if he did it on purpose or not. So it just automatically kills you. It doesn't even just put you in pain, it just kills you. Straight up fries your brain. Oh no! Do they intercept that that transmission from the back? What's going on? They took back in last night. Where? Like, did they sense the signal that she was sending out? Fix Colleen. That's your name, isn't it? Get her! Oh, God. Don't worry, you're fine. Stormtroopers have shit in. That was a really fucking cool transition. Holy shit. I was just about to ask you. There he is. is. You never tell me if it works. If you don't, I'll take the rest of it. I work alone. That's what I'm trying to change. I'm not going to put my people at risk for someone else. We need to pull together, Saul. That's very typical, Saul Guerrero. Whatever our final version of success looks like, there's no. <laughs> no they, trail today, Luthi. They, yeah, good luck. He's very stubborn. Oh no, please don't hurt her. Oh, come on. I really hope they win. Come on, come on, come on, come on. You can do it. I believe in you. God damn it. God damn it. Oh god, I am worried for Bix's health and safety right now. She is not gonna get away unscathed. Um... Ah, uh, God, there's so much going on in these episodes. I feel like I'm just getting, like, lost with who's where and who's working with who and do who's doing what. Um, there's so many viewpoints and so many people. And um, now that we finally have Saul Guerrero, um, we finally have him introduced, uh, That can that's going to get interesting. The entire, like, prison is absolutely fucking terrifying. Like... The whole, like, no shoes and having, like, getting zapped and, you know, walking out of your bed and you get fucking, you just get fried to pieces. Like, what the fuck is that shit? Like, that is, that is such typical Empire, like, shit. I, uh, it's, uh, it's fucking terrifying. They really have, like, they really have succeeded in showing us just how brutal and how little care the Empire has for anyone. They are absolutely fucking terrifying. But yeah, it was a, another another good episode. Um, there wasn't really, I feel like there wasn't really much that I reacted to specifically, mostly because I'm tired and mostly just because there just there was just so much going on that I was just like entranced in it. Like my I I find myself just getting so like stuck into it that I forget that I'm like recording a reaction and that I have to like talk and react to things and say things. Um, so I'm sorry if my reactions aren't as like 
like filled out as usual uh there's probably enough content anyway but i just get so like stuck into it it's just it's so good it's such a good show and i'm really really excited for it um so I'm just wondering how the fuck Cassian is going to get out of this situation because obviously it's not going to be my original thought, which is K2SO, um, like getting a KX droid somehow, but it doesn't seem like there any is any KX droids on this place. So um, I'm going to assume someone's going to help him escape. Maybe it's going to be Saul Guerrero and Luthen. I don't fucking know. At this point, it's really hard to tell how the hell he's going to escape because I can't imagine that he's going to spend all... I mean, maybe they will, because I know they are going to do some time jumps in this, uh, like, between seasons more so, but, like, I, I think it's the entire show is over a course of five years, so I don't think that they're going to do a six-year time skip until when he gets out of prison. I don't think that's going to happen, so something's going to change, something's going to happen. Um, it could be that, uh, oh, I forget her name, hot blonde lady, hot, hot blonde empire lady who we're all rooting for, uh, either she's going to, like, release him so that she can take him or like someone like in like someone's gonna come see him i don't know um it's really really difficult to tell because it's such a deserted place and it's so well like it's got such good security but we know what the rebels are like we know that they can break in and they can do all their fancy schmancy shit um so yeah it's gonna be it's going to be interesting to see how it plays out. Um, so thank you guys so much for watching. If you uh, like to make sure you hit the like button and subscribe for more Star Wars content. I will be releasing Tales of the Jedi content over the next couple of days. Um, and then continuing Andor over the next couple of weeks. And then moving on to Bad Batch eventually. Um, so yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. And I will see you in the next video. So peace and may the force be with you.